Hey what is up guys, so let's just check out the Doogee X55 It looked like iPhone X So let's find out what this phone offers So let's just see here the box, as you can see simple box here, nothing much But on the back we have the specs here, as you can see dual 8 megapixel camera on the back And 18 by 9 full screen here, 5.5 inch We do have a human scanner on the side of the phone 2.5D double glass, so 16 GB memory here 4 core, 2800 milliamps hour battery, Android Nougat, and dual SIM card. So that's made in China here, as you can see it. So let's just open it up. So the phone right away you're going to see here, and it do have a default as a case coming with the phone. So that's kind of nice offering from Doji here. As you can see, that's the fingerprint scanner. So let me put this aside and show you in the box what we have. So simple European adapter for the charging and it's not fast charging anything we have micro USB to the USB cable for the charging here as you can see it plus we have a seam ejecting tool also we do have a screen protector this warranty guide here and there's a booklet which is not nobody gonna see it and this is the screen protector coming with the microfiber cloth so that's a neat so guys let me just put this aside and show you the phone so this is the phone as you can see uh, let me just take out the case here which is really neat guys so we have case with the phone and this is so cheap but it coming with a case so that's good so as you can see you have like, some glassy finish on the back and look at the front let me just peel this off it do look like plastic but kind of feel like glass we do have a default screen protector on it so that's also neat that's a filming scanner plus we have a on and off button here so that's also neat texture on that so as you can see that's a textured so this side we have volume up and down also sim tray there so on the back we do have a screen protector as well in the back so neat neat really neat we have a speaker plus microphone on this side top we have micro USB for the charging and the headphone jack and the back we have dual 8 megapixel camera front we have a FIU so budget device guys so let me just boot this up 1, 2, 3 so yeah guys let me just go through this and I'll catch you back in a second so everything's set up as you can see it so let me show you first of all the setting what's running in here so it's running Android Nougat as you can see out of the box and top of it is running Doogee OS version 2.0 so that's the latest after that you're gonna get an update for Android Nougat 7.1 that's the latest on this phone here also I did run a Geekbench here so let me show you that and that's the latest score coming with this phone and that's expecting 4 core working together and the max gigahertz is 1.30 so that's the gigahertz speed and it comes with only one gigabyte of RAM so that's the reason guys it's kinda really slow really laggy as well also let me just give you side by side comparison with the iPhone X so first of all for the camera as you can see it really similar wise and have more notch in the iPhone X size wise as bigger here the doji one thicker as well display is okay here as you can see more better in the iphone so about the filming scanner it does really work so let me just check it out as sometimes it's kind of laggy and still it's not fast filming scanner in the world but Let's get the job done as you can see about the display color that's the display gonna come 5.5 inch IPS panel here it's great color guys not bad at all for like $85 so that you're getting with the phone also getting the scanner plus the headphone jack well the camera is not that great camera considered to the budget device here but it do get the job done as you can see I just took a picture it's not that great color here 
uh, it's kind of matte finish but it kind of seems classier here but anyway guys let me know what you're thinking about this Doji X55 kind of look like as iPhone X but not have a specs as iPhone X but anyway guys let me know what you're thinking leave your thoughts in comment below and I'll catch you in the next video peace out